President Trump just announced a solution for the border that will infuriate crying Chuck by US4Trump.com. Before departing for Europe Tuesday morning, President Trump answered a few questions from the press. In doing so, he delivered a clear-cut message to illegal immigrants trying to cross the U.S.-Mexico border. President Trump made comments to the press before departing for Europe. His remarks uh, come after being pressed about a California court's decision to reject his administration's request to allow the U.S. government to house illegal immigrant families together while awaiting an appearance before a federal judge. The president said, I have a solution. Uh, tell people not to come to our country illegally. Let's just take a listen. Uh, POTUS earlier at the White House. We have laws. We have borders. Don't come to our country illegally. It's not a good thing. Hashtag special report. I'm saying this very simply. We have laws. We have borders. Don't come to our country illegally. It's not a good thing. There you have it. Well, Chuck Schumer previously said that illegal immigration is wrong. However, when it comes to President Trump, Chuck and his sidekick obstruct anything the president puts forward. Uh, president Trump campaigned on a wall securing the border, protecting and keeping the country safe. This should be no surprise to Democrats, but... Uh, they act shocked at everything Trump does. Chuck Schumer in 2009 said illegal immigration is wrong, plain and simple. Why the change, Chuck? Uh, it's time to get on board and follow suit. The American people voted for President Trump and want to stop the flow of illegal immigration. Uh, watch Chuck's remarks below on illegal immigration. Yeah, we'll look. But... What? Why the change? Because he's put on the Soros payroll. It's very obvious. He pals around with Soros's kid. And look at this advertisement here that I didn't take down. Should illegal immigrants be eligible for Social Security benefits? Isn't that precious, right? Isn't that precious? Now, yeah, I'm more than sure you guys have seen this. We must this. create a system that converts the current flow of primarily low-skilled illegal immigrants into the United States into a more manageable and controlled flow of legal immigrants who can be absorbed by our economy. Let me elaborate. The first of these seven principles is that illegal immigration is wrong, plain and simple. Until the American people are convinced that we will stop future flows of illegal immigration, we will make no progress on dealing with the millions of illegal immigrants who are here now and on rationalizing our system of legal immigration. That's plain and simple and unavoidable. When we use phrases like undocumented workers, we convey a message to the American people that their government is not serious about combating illegal immigration, which the American people overwhelmingly oppose. If you don't think it's illegal, you're not going to say it. I think it is illegal and wrong, and we have to change it. Above all else, the American people want their government to be serious about protecting the public, enforcing the rule of law, and creating a rational system of legal immigration that will proactively fit our needs rather than reactively responding to future waves of illegal immigration. People who enter the United States without our permission are illegal aliens, and illegal aliens should not be treated the same as people who entered the U.S. legally. To the advocates for strong, fair, effective, comprehensive immigration reform, and I'm certainly one, I say to you that the American people will never accept immigration reform unless they truly believe that their government is committed to ending future illegal immigration. And any successful comprehensive immigration reform bill must recognize this fact. Well, the Democrats are too dumb to call him out about why the change, Chuck? Because they're too dumb to know that he's paid by George Soros. There's no other way. Why the change? Come on. Come on. 
They're selling us out. That's basically the bottom line. They're selling our country out for money. Yep, that's what they're doing. That's what the Democrats are doing. And uh, the, uh, the Democrats uh, should walk away. Uh, anybody that supports these Democrats. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.